Hello everyone, welcome to the Software Coding Tutorials channel. My name is Tommy and today I'm going to talk about how to get the minimum and maximum value of a group of columns in SQL. So imagine that this is a job interview question and you have a 3x3 three three SQL table just like the one described below. And the interviewer wants to know the minimum and maximum value for each row. How would you do this in SQL? The answer may surprise you and stay tuned and I'll show you the solution. Okay, so I'm going to create a table with three columns. Column 1, column 2, column 3 with the same float data type here. I'm going to go ahead and click on execute to create the table and refresh. And we should see that table here in the test database with those three columns. Next, I'll go ahead and insert the values for these columns. So there will be four rows with three columns. I'm going to execute it. And if I select star from test, you can see that there are four rows, three columns. Okay. So next, I can create uh, two functions. One function is to return the minimum value for each column. So, so the function will receive um, three arguments, column one, column two, column three as float. Then here you can see that I'm returning as float and I'm going to return back uh, from a subquery. So from the subquery, I get the minimum value and then return the minimum value. And so that will be function uh, get minimum value. For maximum value, I would do the same thing. I will uh, send, out, send in two, three columns and I'll get the maximum from the uh, subquery and return max value. Okay, so I'll go ahead and create it. Create the first function and I'll create the second function. And if you refresh the database, you see you should see that under program mobility and under uh, function and under scalar function, there are two uh, functions that are already created. So it's just a matter of calling it. Okay, so let's go back here. So you can see that I select star from DBO test. I can go ahead and select column one, column two, column three. Okay, and then uh, I can type in get okay, DBO get min value, and I'll pass in column. 1, column 2, column 3 as min and dbo get maximum value from column 1, column 2, column 3 as max. Okay, and if I select this and execute, and as you can see here, it display column one, column two, and column three. Gives me the minimum va value for each row. So the minimum value will be one and max is three. The second row here, you can see that uh, four and six. Third is seven and nine. And then the fourth row will be, will be two and 10, which is the correct answer. Okay, so that's all I have for this tutorial. I hope you enjoy it and uh, if you like this kind of tutorial, please press like and subscribe. 
See you later.